Capital Music Center here to help you decide which might be the best piano for your family to start with. Lots of piano teachers, musicians, churches, schools, universities have purchased and own Yamaha U1s. It is their best-selling upright piano. That doesn't mean it's their best-selling piano. Probably they sell 50 digitals to one acoustic. That's my best guess based on industry data. Now the Yamaha U1 New has a list price of $11,000. That might be well out of the price range of most families starting their child in piano lessons. So we specialize in used pianos, U1s that are like new mint condition. This particular one, for example, it's hard to tell it was ever used, um, yet it's reconditioned and available for less than half the price of a new one. Um, but the question is, how does a digital piano compare? So here's a Yamaha. YDP-184. This is their newest digital piano. It came on the market only in May of 2018 and it is already making it even harder to choose spending 11000 or half the price on a used piano when something like this sounds so amazing. It features their CFX Concert Grand Pianos. That's an $80,000 to $120,000 piano that this is recorded from. So it's truly an amazing piano. It has all three pedals. It has all 88 keys just like an acoustic piano would. The touch on the digital piano compared to acoustic is actually more like a grand than an upright could ever be. So that's one reason people pick digital pianos is because they feel like they get a better key touch like a grand piano would offer. Secondly, the sound. It's really difficult to distinguish. If anything, I'd have to go out on the showroom here to the $80,000 piano to compare what the digital piano would really sound like. So I'm not saying would I choose an $80,000 piano or this $2199 digital piano, of course I would pick the $80,000 grand, but that might be out of the realistic possibility for most families also. And of course this never needs tuning, there's no maintenance. Um, it truly is incredible and you can connect technology like uh, to a computer or to a tablet Download apps to help your kids learn to play Versus this piano doesn't do anything to help you learn to play It's perfect for someone that's maybe had five or ten years of lessons and wants to maybe move into acoustic pianos however, you will lose some of the quality of touch and sound that you have in a digital piano like this so you should seriously consider the Yamaha YDP-184. We also carry the Yamaha P125, and before that was the P115. And let's just talk for a minute about this. People often ask, why are there so many reviews online that say that the P115, which I have right here, why is that the best digital piano for a beginner? We can hardly sell them at all. So what happens is when you compare it to the real deal, a grand or an upright, it doesn't really favor that. How can it for $600? But at $2,199, the YDP-184 is definitely eating into piano sales more than ever before in my 30 years of selling pianos. So you should seriously consider a digital piano for your family. And this, by the way, is the P125, which just replaced the P115, but still has a very lightweight touch in comparison to a Grand Upright or the YDP-184. So come check us out today. We've got lots of used pianos, lots of digital piano models, and just help let us help you decide which is the best for your family. Thank you.